people don't know how you go from having no show to suddenly show. To, well, it surprised me too, going from no show to a show. Um, I worked for about four years for Golden Records, Little Golden Records, and Marshall was the hired staff lyric writer for Little Golden Records. And he asked me if I'd like to do lyrics for, for the company, and I said, yes, I'll do lyrics if you'll let me write the music to go with them. And he agreed to do that. And a, a few months later, Marshall said, have you ever heard of Tamamut? Well, Tamamut was a resort in the Poconos, mostly used by women who were hoping to find a guy and guys who were hoping to get laid. And they came for a week, and there were quite a few writers who lived in a barracks kind of thing, and we would put on a review every week. A different one, a new one. A, a new one. And uh, I was the only one with any children. I had three children by this time. That first year, uh, Marshall was told by the man who ran him and he could do a musical if he had a good idea for one. And he'd had a good idea for a long time. It was The Princess and the Pea. So we wrote that whole thing in about three weeks. And he made me write, there's a song in it called Soft Shoes. I wrote Soft Shoes 11 times mm. until it suited him. And we couldn't find anybody who wanted to produce it until we got to New York when Gene and Bill Eckhart, the designers, and Nori Houghton and T. Hamilton, who were the producers and the owners of the Phoenix Theater, had some space in the summer. And that's how it happened. Then they thought, well, we'll see if we can get ourselves a director. So we auditioned it for George Abbott, who'd been an old friend of my parents, who did it, came down and listened to what there was of it, to be polite, but he didn't really expect to like it very much. He did like it, and he said, well, let's see now, like if you can get it done by, I have May, if you get it done by May. And we had three weeks to write the whole show and write the songs. And I don't know how we did it, except that we worked day, literally day and night. 